Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Being Software Engineer. My name is Akash. So this uh, in this video we are going to learn uh, the ways to implement factory design pattern. So this is the second part of implementing factory design pattern. In the first part I have explained how to implement factory design pattern. So if you have not, uh, that is that was the one of the way and I, I consider that is the unique way. So if you have not uh, watched that video, please watch that video uh, from the I button which will be at the top right corner of this video so um, okay so uh, let's take a quick overview of this video uh, of this previous implementation okay so we have this uh, controller and then this controller has this very uh, vehicle type as uh, variable this will be assigned to this vehicle using path variable then we have create instance type create instance method which will create the instance of um, the particular object and then we have this map we have added all the um, type of objects in the into the map and then we have one interface and this interface has four type of implementations we have bus implementation we have motorcycle implementation okay yeah so for motorcycle we have motorcycle type of implementation so this is like this okay so let's go to now um, okay so let's go to controller once again okay let's go to this uh, factory implementation class so what we are doing is we are creating the hash map first and called uh, of static final and then uh, string as key and value as vehicle and then i am putting all the uh, key and values uh, respective key and values like bicycle uh, key and then uh, its value bicycle auto wired object this is I am putting uh, into the map and I am uh, doing add that post construct so uh, add that post construct what it does is it will initialize this uh, map while server starts okay and then I am uh, creating create instance method here and then in create instance method I am getting uh, the particular objects based based on the type passed based on the vehicle passed okay so this is the actual implementation of this um, factory design pattern in the previous part we have done this so what i will do is i will teach you guys uh, how to do it in other way so let's um, comment this part out <clears throat> so if you still uh, okay it's, let's comment this part out okay so i will take this um, map from here this is one more way and this is again the i think the best way of implementing factory design pattern okay so let's take now vehicle okay we have created one map with string as key and vehicle as value okay hash map and then i will create one method and annotate that method with add that post construct okay uh, private void um, get object let's say or init let's say init instance okay okay so here what I will do is I will um, I will use for each okay I will use here vehicle okay and here I will auto wire this vehicle we can remove this if, as we don't want this okay okay then I will use vehicle list of vehicle okay this is will be the private list of vehicles vehicle list okay let's import it okay <clears throat> okay so we are done that now what why it is list of vehicle because vehicle has different implementation uh, it's this implementation so this is the list of implementation so vehicle is the list of impl its implementation that's why it is that's why we kept it as list of vehicle 
okay now we will what we will do is we will use this vehicle list and we use we will use stream here okay stream dot for each okay because we are doing for each method and then we will use vehicle okay each vehicle and then for each vehicle we will perform some operation okay then okay so what i will do is vehicle dot sorry i will put all this thing to handler okay handler dot put okay handler dot put key comma value so key will be the string get type i have not written this method yet i will write that right now and the value will be vehicle so let's write this uh, method let's create this method in vehicle class okay let's do it here uh, public string get type okay then we have to override this method in every implementation class okay let's override it here and we will uh, use the type of constants okay we have constant here okay we'll use the type uh, so it is bicycle so we'll use bicycle type okay so we are initializing the object from based on the type okay okay <clears throat> like this okay so okay then we will use like this okay and then our constants class is here this is bus this is bus type okay and then car as car type hyphen type okay and then there is one more implementation which is motorcycle okay then motorcycle as motorcycle type sorry motorcycle type okay <coughs> because we added this method in interface that's why they are asking us to add or add that method in uh, its implementation implemented class of the interface okay so let's go now to factory method factory implementation and here we will use okay we already done that so what we'll do what we will do is <coughs> we already have done every all the changes so what will happen is uh, let's go to controller i will explain it from controller okay so we have this bsc slash vehicle and this vehicle type will be the variable type then uh, this vehicle type will come uh, will be the path variable and then this will be assigned to vehicle then um, this will go to vehicle implementation uh, vehicle factory implementation and this will go to create instance okay then in create instance we'll get vehicle type which we passed and then uh, this will go to optional dot nullable we see this is a, a feature of java 8 to check if the value is null or not then um, it will get the vehicle on on the base of the type we passed and then if it is, it is found then it will give the uh, vehicle if it is not found then it will throw the exception illegal argument exception invalid vehicle okay so how it will work is uh, whenever server starts then this will this post construct will be executed and in post construct this vehicle list will be 
will already have a list of vehicles means list of its implementation there are four implementation of it so uh, we'll perform for each loop on this uh, so stream dot for each and then um, for each method of java it then vehicle we will get vehicle out of it then vehicle uh, handler dot put vehicle dot get type uh, type will be which we have used right now so this uh, there will be four type of uh, implementation of this get type bicycle will have bicycle like this okay so we will get the type and then corresponding vehicle will be added into the uh, this um, handler that is map so let's uh, run this application and you will get the link of this application in the description box below so no need to worry about it okay okay so um, let's start this application let's start it, this application oh I think it's already running let me stop this previous application and then restart it Okay, let's start it, this application then. Um, run as Java application. Okay, uh, let's see this if this server is started. Okay, it started on 8080. Okay, uh, so now let's hit it from Postman. Okay, it's already there. Okay, we will hit um, bus type request okay we got bus type uh, this is a bus with maximum speed of 150 km per hour okay we can hit uh, for car type now let's see for other if, if it is working car type okay and yes it is working for car type also this is car with maximum speed of 200 km per hour okay so let's uh, let's understand how it works uh, actually internally okay it, uh, when we re hit the request the request will come to this controller get mapping and then uh, this is the fixed URL and this is the variable URL so this bus type or car, car type will be assigned to this vehicle type and then from this vehicle type from path variable it will be assigned to vehicle and from vehicle uh, we are passing this vehicle to create instance method okay and then we will get the instance here based on the um, okay based on based implementation and then we will get the instance assigned to this um, vehicle factory and based on the instance the specification method will be called and this specification method will return the actual specification which is this is the bicycle with this right or everything okay means actual implementation will get uh, let's see for car like we got for car here now so this is the implementation this car is with maximum speed of 200 km per hour so this is all guys uh, let me know if you want me any other video on any other topic so thank you very much for watching this video if you like this video please like um, this video and yeah